Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time coming across this channel, my name is Vivian and I review Middle Eastern perfumes and talk about faith. In this episode, we're reviewing two new perfumes from Latafa, Ajara Dubai Gold and Ajara Dubai Silver. These two perfumes were released this year from the house of Latafa. One comes in this white and gold packaging and this one comes in this black and silver packaging this is what the bottle looks like the bottle is very this bottle this white and gold bottle is very beautiful and this i think people who love all black will find this really really beautiful this is what the bottles look like the cup is the cup is not heavy it's not plastic either i don't know what it is but it's not heavy at all and it's okay we're going to start with this ajara dubai silver i'm going to go ahead and read out the fragrance notes Top notes are saffron, pineapple, middle notes are coffee arabica, violet leaves, base notes are sandalwood, butterscotch, and vanilla. So I got this first, so I was really thinking that this was going to be a little bit more masculine, but after I sampled it, it's just it's unisex. Go ahead and give this a good spray. Now the atomizer is very beautiful, it comes out a lot. See, mm, I'm just bathing myself in it now. When this opens. I can barely on my skin this barely pulls any pineapple now the top notes are saffron and pineapple but on my skin this barely pulls any pineapple now it's landing on your skin you can easily pick out which notes you're getting first the one that's hitting your skin first the one your skin is pulling the most so once i get the saffron and the sandalwood the saffron this saffron and sandalwood mixture is divine then the coffee begins to come out the coffee here is not that type of coffee that i'm in your face coffee or that coffee in french coffee this coffee is very grounded it keeps the perfume grounded you will know it's there in the background you know just maybe when you catch a whiff of it but it's not pronounced as it dries you begin to pick up on the butterscotch and the vanilla which gives it like almost a creamy feel not so creamy but it just makes you feel like it's creamy a little bit that's what the butterscotch and the vanilla does to this fragrance and it's so beautiful all the notes mixed together they come out very beautiful but i wish the pineapple really came out a little bit more but without that it's still very fine on me this is not a beast mood i mean your face fragrance on me this is not a beast mood perfume on fabrics it pulls like seven to eight hours on skin it does like five hours it's there it's it's the the projection is average if somebody stood close to you or you know if uh, the wind was blowing someone will catch a whiff of your fragrance but it's not like oh i, I just i just walk into a room and it fills the room it's not that type of fragrance but it's also still very beautiful if i was spending at least 10 to 12 hours outside i would layer this with another fragrance that will boost it but if i was just running errands for like four hours five hours i would comfortably wear this alone so i do feel that this is also very versatile so that's all that's all with this ajawa dubai silver so let's talk about this ajawa dubai gold the fragrance uh, the fragrance notes for this one is top notes orange lemon hearts jasmine mango um osmantus base notes amber sandalwood musk and wood i'm going to give this a good spray on this other hand the atomizer is the same it's beautiful hmm. this is beautiful this starts zesty like that um lemon orange peel zesty that's zesty and then i pick up this faint mango note my on my skin this pulls um barely any mangoes i just know it's there when i like sniff i know there's something in the background that's it's that's like mango but it's not so pronounced like it's not pronounced like the one in Tuscan. So this this is followed um by the jasmine and the musk and they come together to give you this um this grounded almost this grounded almost sensual feel it dries as it spends a couple of um hours you get this earthiness but this earthiness is it's not it's not animalic it's not even pronounced it just i feel like it just makes it i don't know i don't see it just makes it like all around okay something like that so this one like the this one like the twin is not a be smooth fragrance on my skin i get four hours with this one and on my clothes i get at least six to seven hours with this one and i feel like that's still pretty okay it's not all perfumes that are meant to be beast mood so if i was going out and i was going to spend a lot of um time outside i would also layer in fact i've layered this one and it came out really beautiful and you know it, it projected the the perfume i layered this with gave it a boost and it's also beautiful so 
in my opinion these two perfumes are very beautiful perfumes and i would give this a 7 out of 10 and i would give this a 8 out of 10 they are beautiful they're, they're for the for the, the longevity match with the price is okay and it's, it's, it's understandable the projection is also it's, it's, it's average it's not bad and it's also okay it's not every day we have these smooth perfumes so I think that Latafa they did good with this one and I think I don't think these are cloning any designer fragrance I think these are original creations and they did okay and it's so beautiful I'm biased between these two perfumes I'm still like trying to figure out which is my favorite for now I do like the butterscotch vanilla that this gives and they dry down and i like how this is also grounded i feel like I'm, i'll keep the two you know wear them to two different places because they just give two different vibes though if i were to gift a man i would gift this i'll give the, i would give this to a man and i'll give this to a lady however you can wear both of them if you don't mind it's perfumes objective so it's totally up to you so that's all for these two perfumes let me know what you think have you tried them will you be trying them what do you think about this video and please don't forget to like share and most importantly subscribe see you next time